Every type of traveller will find something to pique their interest in Italy, from the glistening Tyrrhenian Sea to the picturesque Italian Alps and all points in between. Beautiful Italy is a country rich in history, delicious food and fine wine. Adventurers and foodies, as well as lovers of art and history, will all adore what this nation has to offer. Here's a look at the best places to visit in Italy. Number 10. Cinque Terre. To see a captivating sunset over the Mediterranean, travel to the Cinque Terre seaside region. This area is also referred to as the Five Lands because it is composed of five fishing villages. Among these are Monterosso al Mare, Vernazza, Corniglia, Manarola, and Rio Maggiore. These settlements are connected by a train and lovely meandering roads. One of the nicest places in Italy for a trip with friends because of its beauty and seclusion. Number 9. Pisa. The Leaning Tower of Pisa, also known as La Torre Pendente, is one of the city's top attractions. Despite having a flaw, it became famous for its tremendous elegance in design. When the tower was being built in the 1100s, sinking had already begun by the time it reached the third story, which ultimately caused the lean. Number 8. The Grand Canal. Who hasn't fantasized about taking a gondola in Venice? Maybe nobody. Venice is an island-based metropolis where the waterways serve as the streets. Among those many passageways, the Grand Canal is the largest. Its sides are bordered with the most stunning palaces. These palaces, which were owned by some of the richest families, date from the 13th through the 18th centuries. Number 7. Sicily. Situated in the narrow Strait of Messina, directly across from Italy's southernmost point, is Sicily, the largest island in the Mediterranean. Its history, culture and cuisine are quite different from the rest of the country because of its crossroads location, which has long served as its identity. The greatest example of this is Palermo, the largest and capital city of Sicily, which was astonishingly created more than 2,700 years ago. From the Phoenicians and Romans to the Arabs and Normans, it has been ruled by many civilizations since then, each leaving behind gastronomic influences and artistic and architectural marvels. Number 6. Amalfi Coast. One of Italy's most popular tourist sites, the Amalfi Coast is located in the southwest province of Campania and is renowned for its exceptional beauty. The Amalfi Coast, which stretches 30 miles along the southern edge of the Sorrento Peninsula, is much sought after for its gorgeous shoreline, which includes glittering coves, jagged cliffs, gardens filled with lemon trees, brightly colored villas and opulent resorts. Positano, one of the most elegant and charming towns along the Amalfi coast, is known for its pastel buildings, gorgeous pebble beaches, picturesque mountains, waterfalls, and a black Madonna dating back to the 13th century. Amalfi, one of the bigger towns, has charming plazas dotted with eateries and gift shops. Situated atop a hill with a view of Amalfi, Ravello is well known for its vibrant art and music festivals, as well as its stunning houses with gardens and artwork. Furore, popularly known as the Covered Town, has a charming harbour and a large number of houses covered in murals. Number 5. Vatican City some of the most priceless artwork and art collections in the entire world may be found in the Vatican. The centerpieces of the structure are the huge Basilica of St. Peter and one of Michelangelo's most emotional works, the Pieta. The Pope speaks to devotees outdoors in St. Peter's Square. The Sistine Chapel's walls and ceilings are covered in murals by Michelangelo while Raphael and other renowned artists produced artwork for the Vatican Palace. Number 4. Italian Lake The Italian Lake District is renowned for its stunning lakes and is situated in northern Italy. Since the Roman era, this location has been a popular destination for tourists in Italy. Many vacationers travel to this breathtaking location each year to view and take in its stunning natural settings. Lake Garda and Lake Como. 
fashionistas visit the location frequently to browse the boutiques and enjoy the traditional Italian cuisine. Number three, Venice. Built on an Adriatic sea-encircled lagoon, Venice is one of Italy's most popular tourism destinations. Venice is an archipelago of 118 islands in northern Italy, united by hundreds of exquisite bridges and picturesque canals. The Grand Canal, which splits the city in two, is the most well-known of the canals. Venice has beautiful canals and ancient buildings, making it one of the world's most romantic towns. Although Venice is frequently congested and pricey, it is definitely worth visiting to take in its breathtaking sights, which include Doge's Palace, Rialto Bridge, and St. Mark's Square and Basilica. Gondola rides along the Grand Canal are among the most well-liked activities in Venice. But cruising the peaceful back canals in a Vaporetti is every bit as much fun. Number two, Florence. With so much art and architectural history, Florence, the capital of Tuscany, is frequently referred to as an enormous outdoor museum. Renowned worldwide for being the cradle of the Italian Renaissance, Florence is also recognized for having produced a large number of writers, artists, inventors, scientists, and explorers. It is also credited with creating opera and the Florin money, which helped to save Europe from the Dark Ages. Furthermore, Florence is recognized as the birthplace of the affluent and influential Medici dynasty, which gave rise to multiple monarchs and popes and had a profound cultural, political, and economic influence on the entire world. Florence's hoard of art masterpieces are found all over the city, contained within the large numbers of museums, stunning churches like the domed Santa Maria del Fiore, and internationally esteemed art galleries like the Uffizi and Pitti Palace. Number one, Rome. Presently serving as Italy's capital city, Rome was formerly the center of government for the Roman Empire. Rome, a large, intricate city that is both ancient and contemporary at the same time, is situated in the Lazio area of the country's center. Rome has been a significant hub for culture, politics and religion for more than 2,500 years. It is best known for being home to historic Roman buildings and the Vatican City. Rome is divided into many districts, with the Colosseo area serving as the city's core and housing some of the most iconic historical sites, including the Roman Forum, Capitoline Hill, the Forum of Augustus, and the Colosseum. Old Rome, which is located outside the city centre, is home to the Pantheon, magnificent cathedrals, squares and Renaissance buildings the Sistine Chapel, the Apostolic Palace, and St. Peter's Basilica are the main attractions of the Vatican 